Okay, so Adrian, welcome back to our screens. It's been a while since we've seen you, uh, you know, in the, in the PUC ranks, but how's things yeah. been for you so far? I mean, I've heard that you've been on a bit of a fitness journey over the last few months. Yeah, we've, um, me and my wife have been exercising. We did, what, we did it three months, um, just in the Tyson Fury workouts every day. And then, you know, a couple of mile walk and, and uh, bike rides at night. So it's been, it's been good. How's that been in terms of your practice schedule and, and things during lockdown? I know it's been, it's been a strange time for us all, but you've, you've been focusing on the fitness. Has it helped with your darts as well? Uh, well, I've written on darts today, if that, if that helps. <laughs> so it's not doing too bad. Um, yeah, I think you will do over, over, the, you know, over the long run. Um, but a shadow of a doubt, obviously, if you're better, you're going to be mentally better as well. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to getting back there. It's been a strange year, as we've said, and you know, everyone's well aware of, of how things have been. Uh, in terms of the darts, it's been a long time away from the board and competitive action for a lot of players. We, we saw some people on the home tour, but it, you know that was still in your kitchen or, or bedroom or something. So it's it's going to be a new experience, isn't it, going into this summer series and world match play um, behind closed doors, a bit like a, you know the pro tour series, and it's going to be something different for the players because it's been it's been no competitive action for a long time. Uh, are, you, are you looking forward to getting back, or are you, are you a bit wary of how things may be? Yeah, I'm a bit apprehensive, but I think it's just everybody's in the same boat, so we're all going back. Um, you know, nobody knows what we really expect. Uh, you know, nobody knows what kind of form they're going to be in either, because um, you know, we like to say we haven't played anybody, we haven't played any competitive darts in the last four months. But I think everybody's eager to get back and start playing again. Are you looking forward to what is it being around the, the players again, or that comp competitive nature of? Of you know playing the top players in the sport, um, it's, it's both really. I think you know obviously, like you say, we've been off for that period of time, um, and, and it's just I, mean, I have missed that competitive edge as well. Um, you know, competing. So, um, like I said, I just want to get back there now and uh, hopefully get the ground running. So, twenty twenty, your year so far. How, how do you review things in the early months of the year? Um, you had a couple of good results, a couple of bad ones, maybe. You feel you've been playing okay? Yeah. It's been a bit um, mixed and match, really. I think, uh, you know, I've done quite well on the pro tour so far. Um, probably in the top, I don't know, around the top 10 in that, I think. Uh, should have thought anyway. Um, I haven't really had any too many early exits. So, uh, yeah, I mean, the, the thing is now I just want to go up there and win one or two. The Summer Series is going to be five days of action. Do you feel there's going to be a strain on, on not just yourself, but the, the players, you know, five days after having nothing for a long time? Do you think it could throw up some weird results in the field? Um, I, I think, yeah, certainly the early days. I think um, for a couple of days, everybody's still going to be settling in. Um, but I think overall, um, it shouldn't be that too much of a problem. I think everybody knows what they're there to do. And that's what it's about, really. You know, they're doing each job, really. We know you're a very rhythmic player. You know, you play on the speed of your opponent. Do you feel that these new rules and the social distancing that's come in might affect you in, in any way? Um, not really. I think, it's, like I say, yeah, maybe the first day, just getting used to it. I might have a few cautions in mind if I'm, if I'm trying to chase uh, you know, the opposition uh, to the hockey. But um, I think overall, I think, yeah, I will be all right. I don't see being too much of a problem. What about looking forward to the match play? I know it's it's sad news. It's not going to be at the uh, the famous mm -hmm. Winter Gardens. A lot of players feel that that's maybe behind Ali Pali the most special tournament, or some it's even their favourite. Do you feel it's going to be? It, well, it's going to be a different yeah. experience. Obviously, do you feel it could yeah. benefit you in any way, or do you need that crowd there? Do you think it, it could no, help? It you? you know, it's the second biggest tournament. Um, my favourite tournament as well, and it, I think it will be missed being you know in the Blackpool. So uh, it's going to be tough. Man. It's going to be really tough. Like you say, we've got no atmosphere. It's, it's going to be quite. I don't know if the PDC can come up with something where, like at the football, if you've seen, you know, they've got all the, the crowd noise now in the background. Maybe we could have a bit of that going on. I'm not sure. It's just going to be a, a sad time. Yeah. But it sort of makes it a, a pro tour event. Do you think that helps level the field, or do you think there's still an advantage to, to some of the big boys? Um. I mean, like I say, myself, I prefer the crowd in there. Other players prefer it, you know, on a quieter level. Um, uh, you know, Ian White could have a really good run in a match play because, um, you know, he loves the floor tournaments. He's one of the, well, he's probably in the top three in the players in the, on the pro tour. But he could uh, settle in quite well. He'll be one watching that. Over the previous two match plays, it's been 
early exits for yourself, but they've been against two mm. players that have gone on and done very well. Um, so yeah. do you feel that you know you've certainly still got it to to be up there at the top? And they they were just some early results, which you know against two players that were playing very well at the yeah, time. Yeah, I mean, I've, I've, I've had some like I say, I've, I've played some brilliant matches in the match play, uh, and I played some rubbish ones. And uh, you know, last year against Glenn, didn't really play that well. Um, but to be fair to him, he, he had his best game in the against me. I know everybody, everybody says, you know, against MVG and so on, but he had his eyes average against me. Um, but it's, it's one of them, you, you know, you have to take it on the chin and just say, you know, he was a better player on the day and just move on. So what's the rest of the year going to hold for you? I know the PC is still working hard on getting as many events on yeah. as possible, certainly with crowds towards the, the latter part of the year. What, what are your hopes going into the rest of 2020? Um, hopefully try, you know, just, just try one as much as I can. Um, you know, that's, that's my focus. Uh, just, just keep going up there and, and you know, obviously I won't, won't be a lot more consistent than what I've been over the past 18 months. Um, you know, I'm in the top 16, but obviously me, me hope so to, to, to definitely get back in the top eight, if not I. Going back to your fitness journey, do you think that, that can help you? You've been able to focus on that and you're looking really well, say to myself, you, you've done you've done well over the last few months to, to keep focused on something like that. Do you think that's going to help you going back into your darts? Yeah, I think, you know, I think, I think it's, because obviously when we're playing tournaments and everything all the time and we're on the road all the time, it's hard for, you know, for, for really, when, when you get home, basically, you don't really want to start doing fitness and stuff and that, you know, you just want to relax and, and that's spending a bit of time with the family. But now we've had this four months off, and you've had a bit of time to do all these different things. It's certainly opened my eyes. And like I say, I feel a lot more better, a lot fresher, and I'm ready to go. Itching to get back. We're looking forward to seeing you back on our screen. So uh, good luck in the summer series, the match play, and we'll, um, we'll see you in action soon. Nice one. All the best. Thank you.